Welcome to summer in the UK. Cold, grey, miserable and the threat of torrential rain at any second. <laughs> Just a normal summer's day for us up north. So out with Mrs Metalman today I've took up uh, Cow Green Reservoir, a place I've been to many times before. Uh, but a first for her. I don't think she's that impressed. But <laughs> Uh, unfortunately she didn't bring a warm jacket with her. When you get up the dale and you get on top of these mowers, it's always cold, it's always windy, the wind is always a cold wind, so I want to give her one of my little jackets as well, keep her warm. When they talk about the mowers, they talk about being cold, grey, and damp and misty and desolate this is what they're talking about I hope that's mist behind us and not rain coming in first day of my summer holidays believe it or not so I say a while since I've been up here I used to come up umpteen times before years ago with the Tiffin Trotters would walk for miles and miles and not see anybody Again, when you look around, you can see why not many people want to come here. And I hope that's not rain coming over. Here it is, it'll be a very quick sprint back to the car. So that's the reservoir there, Cow Green Reservoir. In all the years I've been up here, I've never seen it so empty. Normally very, very full. You get a lot of rain up here. But the beginning of the year, it was dry for a good couple of months. It's really took its toll up here. Although trust us, as soon as we come up here, the rain starts. Mrs. Melman's looking a bit chilly, I think. Let's see if we can find a place to shelter. Well, that's the trouble up here. There's not that many places to shelter. And that's how the weather changes up here. That was a bit of rain there, but it was just a rain shower. It just went over the top of us. And two minutes later, it's starting to brighten up a lot. Either way, let's just enjoy the holidays. It looks like another rain shower pulling in. I don't believe it. The sun's actually popping out. See, so you've got to be optimistic. Always wear your sunglasses, brings out the sun eventually. So the dam head there, keeping uh, the reservoir at bay. But uh, that's cauldron snout which drops from the reservoir all the way down there and it does go down right down and joins it the, the river Tees. So it's a really nice place to come and have a little bit of a, a rock scramble. I know my grandson uh, Harry Metalman would have really enjoyed it up here. You can see a very rubbly, rocky path going down there, it goes up and it goes down. This is Metal Man is sat at the top and she couldn't feel confident coming down here which is no problem at all so I don't want to leave it too long especially as she's got all the food and I'm getting a bit hungry there now so I'll climb back up for a spot of lunch I think Here comes the rain again 
falling up and down like a memory. Ooh. She's loving it. <laughs> and as quick as that squally shower came, it's gone. So we're going to beast it back to the car there now. Have a bit of lunch. I think we'd got in just in time, I think. Because then heavens are going to open before long. So, an enjoyable walk out, blustery walk out. First day, me holders. But, uh, <laughs> hopefully, you get the hope of the worst first. But uh, blown the cobwebs away. I've really enjoyed it. So, what are your thoughts? <laughs> Say nothing. <laughs> anyway, so I'm have to call it a day here. I think. Uh, but anyway, thank you very much for watching and. Uh, Hopefully we'll be back out very, very soon in better conditions.